to office hours. Well, I say I go to my professor's office maybe like three times a day, maybe more. It depends on how many questions I have. Like yesterday, I went to him because I was talking to him because I had this question just randomly popped into my head. Let me think, what was it? Um, it wasn't astronomy related, which is why he got mad and he kicked me out because apparently I have to ask questions that are related to the class and that doesn't really make sense to me. I decided to ask him a question. So anyway, the question was, something about crop circles? Hmm. Can a crop circle be a square? Apparently he said yes. I think that's the conclusion we came to, but I think he might have said that just to kick me out. My name is Professor Doctor. Um, I, I am the, the revered professor of alternative astronomy here at the University of Texas. Um, most people know the nine planets by the acronym, uh, my very excellent mother just served us nine pickles, but uh, I prefer my personal copyrighted acronym, Miss Veronica eats meaty jelly beans so Utah never prospers. Now, I enjoyed having Lucy in my class for a semester because, as you know, being an astronomy professor, I don't get a lot of people here in my office hours. Uh, however, it started to get a little weird, especially considered she started showing up after she had graduated from my class. Why does the Easter Bunny lay eggs? It doesn't make sense, because bunnies can't lay eggs, you know? Do you know what I mean? It doesn't make any sense, but I get that it was like probably Hello, like some sort of like traditional friend. thing that happened, but it just doesn't make I've any vibe. Now, if you'll follow me over here, as you can see, there is a uh, s slightly greasy sleeping bag on the floor here, and a nice sign. Uh, some sort of uh, water bowl. I guess I'm uh, glad she's staying hydrated over here. Uh, cookies and some uh, home brand soup. Uh, I myself am a Campbell's Chunky Man because the large chunks of meat tend to remind me of the asteroid belt between the planets Mars and Jupiter. Oh god, uh, so she's pretty interesting you know she's never really around here because i don't know she's going off studying or something i really don't care uh but her questions have just really been kind of annoying so i ended up just throwing some flashcards out the door for her and you know she hasn't been back since so wait she's coming back no! i'm nancy fur you might not know because i look so young but i'm i'm lucy's mother she was always such a sweet girl. She worked so hard in school. She was really quiet though, but she had lots of friends. I promise I have proof. Like, I, I have a lot of pictures. She was in after school activities, but I don't know. I feel like maybe this was partly my fault. Once I just took her aside and I thought maybe she was too quiet, so I asked her if Maybe she could show her curious side, just ask more questions. I didn't know this would get so far though, because she's an economics major. Like, this isn't even for credit. Like, astronomy. I don't know where she's gonna go in life. Like, she doesn't even go to classes anymore. She just sleeps in this old man's room. Like, <laughs> Lucy is. Um, she, she, she's. She's. Uh, she's. She's difficult. She's difficult. Sometimes. Just holding my syllabus close to my face it makes me feel warm. This, yes, this is her seventh intervention. Usually these things don't go as planned. The seventh time, you know what they say, seventh time's the charm, huh? <laughs> we want to help you to get through this together. Right? Yeah. Oh, wait, why am I here? Yes, I, I'd like to move this along as fast as possible. I am keynoting a speech on whether or not aliens would enjoy eating mashed potatoes later, and frankly, this is a colossal waste of both mine and your time. <laughs> Why don't we start with some wonderful words of encouragement? I checked MTV, and I checked all like the new youth culture, and this isn't a new mem or whatever, like you need to be normal again. <laughs> no, uh-oh, -uh. got nothing. Oh wait, why am I here? So professor, why do they call it quicksand if it actually works really slow? Doesn't make any sense. You are all terrible, terrible people. Lucy, you are without help because you people are helpless. I am out of here, I am done. <laughs> Seventh time's the charm, huh? <laughs>